All right. Hello. Hello, everybody. Okay, so does that mean you got the same Facebook update that I just did yeah, about the I show did. last All the night? Photos. Yeah. I need this camera. It's this really is really upsetting. good. Yeah. Hello, this is the G Spot. Thank you very much for checking in with us today. I'm Skokie G. I'm Slade Vegas. And what we are currently talking about is a show that my group called Zoch did last night. It was a show at Goldmine Tavern in Henderson. It was pretty cool. And a friend of ours, Chaz Lahogny. No, that's not her last name anymore. Wait, hold on. What is Chaz Fair? Baron. Ah, see, because that Whatever. was her maiden name back when you knew her in the high school. In the high school. In the high the school, high school. <laughs> yes, yeah. the high school. <laughs> anyway, she took these lovely photos that, like, literally, as we hit play to do the show, she tagged us like, all in and posted really all fun. these. Uh, the, I'm just, I'm impressed by the quality of the camera itself. Yeah, this is really cool. I don't know what type of camera it is. It was a is. Canon. A Sorry, Canon. I guess I could have mentioned that. I, I want a <laughs> Canon. Blow things up. <laughs> Not that type of canon. I my outfit looks really fun. Wait, uh, there are photos of you because I haven't. I've only seen. See, I have. I oh haven't seen those gee, ones. I only saw the ones of me. Oh, because it's just the ones that are tagged. Oh, we have to I, look at the whole. They're album. not exactly the most beautiful photos of me, but then again, every photo of you is beautiful. Oh, uh, <laughs> whatever. But yeah, the show was really good last night. Goldmine Tavern. The the people there were super awesome, super nice. They did everything they said they would do and that is very That's rare good. yeah for like small club venue venue type places they people generally like the one you booked with she was actually there right yeah she was there um yeah cuz i've been in so many situations where like they don't want to pay you or they try to hustle or something something right. stupid always renegotiate like when you d you yeah. are done playing so like the only the only time things work great for a musician is when you're dealing with you know the big leagues of big concert halls or whatever like that but so every once in a while when you work a small club it you kind of get screwed over but last night none of that happened they no, were super it super was awesome super positive actually even the people that were there prior were um enjoying the sets i mean you guys did thank great thank you it was fun didn't hurt that the drinks are super cheap yes 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 yes, yes. heavy-handed bartenders are always the best <laughs> slade <laughs> had fun last night <laughs> as did several I other friends well i had to go <laughs> oh see fatty our dog fatty is trying to get in on the show he wants you want to talk microphone. you want to talk <laughs> these dogs would not shut up all day and now all of a sudden they won't bark, really? Right. We were watching a Close me, spark. Bark. Bark. We bark. were watching a very emotional bark. documentary today instead of the Super Bowl. Although we did watch the the halftime. Oh, there's one. That's that's Ghostface. All right, oh. now get out. Get out of here. <laughs> get, get out of here. You're bothering me. Yeah, we started watching Blackfish on Netflix. And that was I don't think that I only ever went to SeaWorld once. And it was not all that. It wasn't exciting to me, I guess. I didn't really care. But I'm not an amusement park kind of person. Like, sitting and watching an animal jump all over a trainer is not something I'm actually... I, I don't enjoy it. I went to the San Diego one. Yeah, that's the one I went to. Back when, I think, like, 98, 90, not 90, 97, 98. Okay, I don't remember it. too much. We didn't, like, watch any cool shows or anything. But anyway, this this documentary is very sad because it shows the behind the, it shows what they're actually doing as opposed to the veneer of what they're trying to pass off I yeah guess. i don't know <coughs> but it, was, it cool. was it was powerful it was it was i cried yeah totally. it, on both aspects of the animals and the trainers it's just sad yeah but uh then after that yeah we totally we, we caught the super bowl the halftime half show show the chili peppers were cool bruno Noticed mars was awesome bruno mars was great yeah. Noticed. That yes, the Chili Peppers guitars were not plugged in, but so, that so do you think that maybe that's why Josh and Flea were so no, like dramatic? They always are crazy on stage. Like that's the beauty. That, like that's why Flea is so good. Not only is he a great musician and bass player mm -hmm. and all around like that, he does these crazy things while playing good at the same time. Well, well while playing well. Excuse well, me. yeah. Cause, well, because my first thought before you mentioned that they weren't plugged in to an amp was that he was dancing really like upbeat and moving crazy mm -hmm. and the bass line that was being played was actually kind of more jazz ish it wasn't that 
crazy slap sound. Uh, so I noticed like the dance didn't match the bass. Ah, uh, well, the, he he was on key with it. Oh no, 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 no! I don't mean that. I'm not insulting your favorite band, Jesus. <laughs> he just got offended. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> don't talk bad about them. <laughs> no. Anthony Kiedis' his mustache, though. Come on. Mustache rides. It's yeah. weird. Although, yeah, I did notice. I don't think he was pre-recorded. No, like, I don't. I don't. Yeah. I mean, maybe he had a, a quieter backtrack or something. Maybe, but something like that. But it was cool, even though they played half of Give It Away. Still cool. You know, it wasn't <laughs> their show. No, it was Bruno Mars. It was Bruno Mars' show, so, but yeah. I'm just very happy that they got to be a it was part cool. of that. Yeah, that's history right there. 43rd football? 46? So I don't know. In the 40 Super Bowls, so that's... <laughs> it shows how much sports we actually oh, watch. Co- coming up next, we're going to talk about the end of the game and who was the VIP. Not VIP. No, I don't know. The I'll game's still to... going on <laughs> right <laughs> I now. I was just trying... <laughs> As people listen to this tomorrow and the next day, all two of our viewers. Viewers, <laughs> listeners. Well, we did also... We got to get out of the house for a minute. And we ran up to Avatar uh, Comics, and, games. and I wanted to say thank you to, how many books did we drop off last week? Uh, like 12? Something of that nature. Yeah, so however many people ended up coming down to Avatar, thank you for picking up a copy, um, and I hope you enjoy it, because they're all gone. So. Yay. We'll drop more <laughs> off here sometime yeah, this week. Good thing I have a bunch. Yeah, but buy you don't have to buy the book, but, but go buy a comic yeah, or a game. Yeah, the book is free, but, you know, support local business. We, you know, kind of all love each other, yeah. so. Yeah, hashtag Avatar Comics and Games. That's how we roll there. Anyway. Hashtag, hashtag. Hashtag your hashtag. <laughs> I'll start a, I want to start a band and call it hashtag. I like hashtags. I love it. I think it's fun. It's, I, it's it's for the lazy internet searcher. Like, I don't know how to search the web for things. Yeah, right. I, I like, suck at it. <laughs> I like doing um like like popular things. Like let's let's use Las Vegas. Like, and when you hashtag Las Vegas Vegas or whenever I do, I'll post it and then wait two seconds literally and see how how many people after me have posted something about Las Vegas, and it's just you know so so many so. Uh, do that next time, like hashtag something very popular, uh huh, and then just wait, just and a see few what happens. Seconds. No, and then then go look at the hashtags and see that you're like tenth, you're ten people uh, after you posted something immediately. Oh really? Oh yeah, that's my favorite thing to do. So I had no idea that oh, actually gosh. occurred like that. Yeah, that's how oh. you search. See, that's how more I find photos keep getting posted, and I have no control over this. See, people. <clears throat> I don't mind them. They're not. They're very good quality photos. I am making derp faces in every photo. Derp. But I don't mind it. That's right. It's okay. Some people don't like. I like to think I've am evolved past that. Well, I, you can, <laughs> I can. You take a good picture of me, but I also make a lot of dumb faces intentionally. And plus, I just well. look. I look derpy, as you say. <laughs> you don't say that, but I, I can look derpy. But yeah. So people come. Don't just look at these photos, which we will. You can see it on our Facebooks. Is bookses, 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 bookses. But yeah, come see the live thing. We're gonna be two weeks from now. We're gonna be. That's the fifteenth. The fifteenth. The, the of day February. after uh, Valentine's Day, we'll be at the House of Blues. I believe eight o'clock. Uh, you know what? That's a good question. I think it's eight o'clock. It's the Envy Showcase um, at House of Blues, not in the courtyard, but in the actual like, the big venue. Stage. Yeah, the big stage. Playing you can like big fart in that now. sound system, and it would sound like poetry. Oh my goodness! Like. <laughs> I'm hoping because when I played the joint years ago, we spoke the about the new joint. The new joint, yes. yeah. We talked about that last episode when yeah. I was in the band Kush. I played that that gig with a busted speaker, and I I, I still, forgot about that. Oh yeah, like I was panicking, but I that's the best I probably have ever sounded too. Well, you had techs too, like oh, you had a guitar tech. Oh, it, there was a, a monitor tech. I could, well, not a guitar. Like, how I, did I, I didn't feel have a to have like a tech though? Yeah, I felt kind of weird like asking for more or less of things in my <laughs> monitor because I. I like in my head, I'm thinking the 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 crew was like, okay, we're setting up for uh, Allison Chains. We're doing this, that, that, and this. And then, oh, here's this this band, this little they, right, this they, little local. Yeah, they get 15 <laughs> minutes, and oh boy, yeah, we had we played that 15 minutes. But yeah, I was just like, what are they thinking? But no, they they were nice too. Like afterwards, they're like, hopefully, uh, we'll be doing this again for you on a larger scale and stuff. And I was like, oh, thanks. Like, <laughs> you didn't have to say that. But like, stroke your ego more, but you know, or, yeah. yeah, or just be like, <laughs> get the hell out of here. <laughs> 
Well, it, I mean, it's kind of part of their job too, right? Right. Well, like that show where we had all access passes, you know, because we were part of the show. Yeah. So me and the drummer Jason, uh, as uh, <laughs> as Allison Chains went on, we w- were like, okay, let's go in the back. So we stood back there, and like as they came down, we were just like. <laughs> like I'm nodding my head now. I was like, gonna say you didn't see this, like, but like he nodded hey, his head. Hey, <laughs> like and we're like, yeah. So I, like for like one second, you got to go. I feel like I'm on the same level as I was. I don't know. <laughs> like it, it, there's like an elevator back there to other to to your green room and yeah. stuff like that. And uh, I was too busy trying to get ready, or just like on cloud nine to even not even think that I could have gone, gone exploring. Like, I, I could have gone and pissed off Alice in Chains. Like, it'd be like, oh, hey, guys, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> or something stupid like that. <laughs> so, oh uh, God. I, I could, yeah. Well, I not could. like I was going to, but, like, I could have at least, like, walked by. But you had the option, and, and you didn't. Yeah, I, I didn't think about it until <laughs> afterwards. Yeah. And yet again, that was another fun night for you. All right, we're just making me <laughs> seem like I'm an alcoholic. I mean, it's, it's it, yeah. Look, it's not my fault that people like to buy me beverages. Yes, they do. That night was your aunt's fault, by yes. the way, calling her out. My family likes to get you drunk. Tequila. My brother got you drunk last night. Uh, tequila. No, not last night was whiskey. Pickle shots. Pickle shots are fun. And we, we, we I converted don't... some people into that last night, too. I, I think, think we did. I think Will, my drummer, was like, <laughs> yeah. And my brother, well, already hand, not so much. drinking Jameson like it's freaking water. That's right. So. And it is. It is <laughs> water nectar of the goddesses is because there's several. Yes. There's seven and a half goddesses. Yeah, one's a half nug, but she's still hot. <laughs> I, don't I, I don't even know where you're going with this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but back to how the show should go. We're gonna go to another music break. Well, not another. This be the first one. We're only gonna do two segments this time. But this is a song called "My Suicide." I don't. Con- not supporting that. Don't say do it. But it's called My Suicide from a band I was in called Kill Jaden. It's a live recording that I got. I don't know how I got this. Um, a friend of a friend of the band at the time gave it. It's kind of a, it's a low quality thing, but you know it's something. The only thing that I have. Wait, somebody just basically recorded you while you were on stage. I think it was. I think this was taken like a like a video and then transferred. To the uh, like the video wasn't that good. Oh, that's kind of well. Cool the though. audio is not all that great too. But hey, it's still something. I'm, no, that's cool. It was a metal band I was a part of, and it was cool. So here we go with my suicide. <laughs> Thank you. 
You know, I'm super curious who the woo girl was in that recording. God, that'd be really funny if it was you. I hate you so nah, much right now. <laughs> you don't really cheer like that. I, I'm not a woo girl. I'm nah. really. Nah, yeah, even when I play. No. Yeah. Woo, but... woo girls are fun, and they're very much Oh, no, I, I love the shows. woo girl. They bring a certain amount of energy to the right places. I'm just not one of them. And then there's the woo guy at a show, which uh, there's two versions of the woo guy. There's the one that's like, I'm, I think I'm the first version. I want to, I want to dub it the first one <laughs> um, where, yeah, something happens and woo, that was cool. And then there's the guy who's just, you know, he's the dude who, who yelled out free bird or right. you know, he's that guy. <laughs> and there's always that guy. Or as we uh, sometimes like to call them the asshole. Yes. <laughs> yes. But then, yeah. so, but then sometimes with the second male woo guy they buy shots sometimes that's true yeah no, that's good too so they're always a supporter of a good time so they're not a bad thing yeah i'm not saying they're bad but they, there's there's that guy <laughs> yeah there's there's like several that guys and yeah. that girl more guys than girls this is very weird okay so to separate from that topic so we're actually going to be hosting a garage sale that i'm kind of referring to as a community sale on the 23rd of february There'll be an uh, an event made. Um, you can invite whoever you want to come down. Basically, what it is, I have too much stuff. I am a trinkety collector of all things weird and random and non interesting, and maybe it's just time to give them a new home. Yes, and then get more new stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so the whole idea is that Skokie and I will be selling our possessions. Not because we're going to be put on the street or destitute, just because we just don't need it and maybe somebody else will want it yes. or repurpose it for something greater than just collecting dust. Mm -hmm. I'm not kidding when I say like literally things I paid a lot of money for, I'll probably give it away for two bucks. Yes. I don't even care. That's the garage sale. Yeah, right. You can't, so. we're, but we're also going to have um, like other people are other individuals. In um, one individual is going to be actually selling vintage bikes mm -hmm. like bicycles. Ooh. Um, there'll be comics Pro and provided by myself and Avatar, and Avatar comics, comics and, and games. games. Hashtag. Um, I, you know, there's just a ton of stuff. Oh, my favorite piece that we're getting rid of is the television I broke. Oh, so we, uh, yeah, she. I broke a TV. It, it, it was a Wiimote accident. Yes. And. But she wasn't playing it. It just, she placed. I placed something very gingerly across the room and it landed on the TV screen, <clears throat> causing like a bullet hole looking ricochet mark in the screen. It's pretty hardcore. So basically what I'm repurposing it as target practice. Any of you gun enthusiasts or archery enthusiasts take that shit out to the middle of the desert and unload on it or i'll will. charge like if five bucks yeah <laughs> or if you can fix it you got i don't doubt you can i don't even know if anybody but can hey fix five a bucks screen. for a tv you can still see the tv i mean it's still viewable yeah, no. it's just <laughs> no it's no it's a massive paperweight slayed conquered destroyed <laughs> slayed smash yes smashy <laughs> smashy smashy <laughs> But yeah, so that's going to happen on the 23rd at 10 in the morning, and it's pretty much going to be, what, doing flyers at uh, tattoo shops, at Avatar. We will be flyering for flyering first Friday. Flyering Friday, which is this upcoming Friday. It was yes. the 7th? Yes. Yeah. So it'll be fun. It'll be a good time. Yeah. It'll be a nice way to spend a Sunday afternoon with your folk. All right. With that said. I guess we're done rambling. Yeah. That's yeah, we'll let you guys get back to your regularly uh, planned events this evening. Thanks for tuning in, and have a great night. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>